welcome to Today on the Green. We're your hosts, I'm Bridget, and that's Evie. So we hope everyone had a fun weekend, because on the weekend, it was homecoming! Mm -hmm. Yay! Yeah. So, did you have fun at homecoming? What did you like mm -hmm. about it? I did. I did have a lot of fun. There were rides, there were fun snacks, there was really good music, everyone was dancing, it was awesome. Did you go to homecoming? Well, I actually did try to get into homecoming, but when I arrived there, they told me that I wasn't allowed within 100 feet of the premises, so they escorted me off, but I hope that everyone else had a really good time. Hey, that's not true, but we have Tyler with more information about homecoming. This past weekend was homecoming weekend. Friday, we had the homecoming football game, and at halftime, the homecoming queen w was announced. Saturday night, ev everyone went to the homecoming dance. It was a fun night of dancing, games, and carnival rides. At the end of the night, the homecoming king got his crown. Ho hopefully, all of you had a great time. Now, back to the studio. Thanks, Tyler. Also, tonight is College Info Night at the library at 6.30. So if you're interested, go in at 6.30 to the library. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And anyone is welcome to come, any grade mm -hmm. level. Mm -hmm. Along with stuff about colleges, we also have more college presentations throughout the year. So if you're interested and you want to learn more about those colleges, go to the library and scan those QR codes. Mm -hmm. Now we have Madison with a report on recent sports right now. Hi, I'm Madison, your pro sports correspondent. There are less than two weeks remaining in the 2023 MLB regular season until the intensity of October baseball arrives. So far, there have been six teams to clean postseason spots. Atlanta Braves, Los Angeles Dodgers, Baltimore Orioles, Tampa Bay Rays, Milwaukee Brewers, and Minnesota Twins. The first team to lock up a playoff spot were the red-hot Atlanta Braves. They're going into the playoffs for the sixth straight season, this time holding the best record in baseball. Following the Braves are the Los Angeles Dodgers, who secured their 10th National League West title over the past 11 seasons. Next up playing the postseason are the Baltimore Orioles for the first time since 2016. The Rays are also headed to the playoffs for the fifth straight season as a result of the Cleveland Guardians beating the Texas Rangers. The Minnesota Twins are also making their first playoff appearance since 2020 and hoping to snap their 18 playoff game losing streak. Last but not least, the Milwaukee Brewers are going to the postseason for the fifth time in the past six seasons. Every season, there are always teams who either shock fans by making the playoffs or by having disappointing seasons. For instance, the New York Yankees, an iconic and legendary franchise, are not making the playoffs for the first time since 2016. On the other hand, there are teams like the Los Angeles Dodgers, whose playoffs hopes and dreams were long gone before there was any talk about October baseball. The two best National League teams are the favorites to win a championship title, the Atlanta Braves and the Los Angeles Dodgers. The Braves have been led almost all season long by Ronald Acuna Jr., who is making a case for National League MVP. Doing the same for the Dodgers is Mookie Betts. Let's see what some Bearcat students think. Definitely the Dodgers because, yeah, they're, they're him. You know, we have Mookie Betts. No one's going to beat Marcus Lynn Betts, you know? So, yeah. Gavin, what do you think? I think the Mariners. Why? Because I know Ty France. And uh, I got faith. However, despite having the best record in baseball, that does not always promise a World Series victory. Almost every season, it has been proven wrong that the hottest team does not always win because of their domination during the regular season. Every game in the postseason matters because it only takes one bad game, one bad pitching start, or one hot batter to prove that their regular season record means nothing now. Thanks, Madison. The sports are sporting. And that concludes today's episode of Today on the Green. Tune in tomorrow to see what happens today on the green. Tomorrow! tomorrow!